Classical physics refers to the conventional forces that were identified and developed prior to the turn of the 20th century. Mechanics, acoustics, optics, thermodynamics, and electricity and magnetism are some of the physics studied in classical physics. One of the most fundamental questions to ask about any physical object is how it moves and what causes it to move in that manner. Whether it's a space shuttle zooming past at 17,000 miles per hour or the atoms in rocks at the summit of Mount Everest moving back and forth in place, everything moves to some extent. Important information about an object can be discovered by describing its motion and attempting to figure out why it moves the way it does. This study of motion and the causes of motion is called mechanics. Acoustics is a branch of physics concerned with the study of sound. It can be more defined as a science concerned with the study of sound and its production, transmission, and effects. The primary goal of acoustics is to improve the sound quality of music or communication. It is accomplished by lowering sound barriers and enhancing elements that aid in the proper transmission of sound waves. Originally, acoustics was mainly employed in sectors that relied on sound, such as auditoriums and theaters. But today, acoustics is used in a wide range of fields. The visible light spectrum, like all other types of light, is absorbed and released in the form of tiny pockets of energy called photons. These photons have the characteristics of both a wave and a particle. As a result, this phenomenon is referred to as wave-particle duality, and the study of light in physics is referred to as optics. Optics is a branch of physics concerned with light and its behavioral patterns and properties as well as its interactions with matter and the instruments that detect it. Thermodynamics is a discipline of physics that studies heat, work, and temperature as well as their relationships with energy, radiation, and matter's physical properties. It discusses how thermal energy is transformed to or from other forms of energy, as well as how this process affects matter. The energy derived from heat is known as thermal energy. The movement of microscopic particles within an object generates heat, and the faster these particles move, the more heat is produced. The science of charge as well as the forces and fields that are related to charge is known as electromagnetism. Electromagnetism includes two aspects, electricity and magnetism. The electromagnetic force between electrically charged particles is the subject of electromagnetism. Electromagnetism is a fundamental force that binds electrons to the nucleus and is responsible for the nucleus and their structure. This force exists between electrically charged particles and functions as a link between them. It's the result of interaction of all magnetic and electrical forces.